Hi, I'm Nathaniel Deal, and this is the Universal Kit 3.0 Overview. So this is our first kit to feature the new Ammo Counter V3 chip. The Universal Kit 3.0 ships as seen here. If you'd like to learn more about the complete features of that chip, the link can be found below in the description. You can choose between eight different color displays on checkout. You can also pick between Picatinny or Nerf mounts. It's very similar to the previous versions, but requires less room and in installation. This kit is designed for monitors who want minimal design and have a little bit of room in their blaster to do it. It's perfect for any application ranging from springers that need protection from dry firing to full auto flywheel spewing darts faster than the eye can see. The outer casing allows you to mount the counter face in any position. Just remove the two screws in the back to pull the face out. The back of the face has connectors for power, the IR beam, and a reset switch. The power connector is connected to a step-down converter that is located in the back of the casing. This will allow you to connect the universal kit to any power source between 5 and 24 volts. The IR beam connector will allow you to connect an IR beam or a fire switch in order to count down. The reset connector is optional and you'll need to connect two wires and rewire the clip safety switch in your blaster in order to use it. We plan to make another video about that installation in the future. This is very important. These wires can sometimes get in the way of these screws. So please make sure that the wires are clear of the screws before reinserting the face. Once you have that, replace the two screws in the back and your counter will be secure. The Universal Kit 3.0 comes with a 9 volt battery connector. You can connect the 9 volt battery or choose to wire it to an existing battery in your blaster. Once the power is connected, turn the counter on by locating the toggle switch on the back. Now you're ready to mount the counter and install the IR beam. The IR beam can be installed internally around your Nerf barrel by drilling a hole through the barrel and sliding it inside. There is a video available already on YouTube about how to install this, so if you would like to learn more, the link can be found below in the description. You can also choose to purchase a muzzle brake from AmmoCounter.com that will install at the end of your Nerf barrel and house the IR beam. These are available in orange or black. So that's it for the Ammo Counter Universal Kit 3.0. It is now available for purchase on AmmoCounter.com. Thanks for everyone that continue to support Ammo Counter. And again, happy nerfing.